Hello everybody and welcome back to Rebellious Menstruation. Today I will be reviewing this low-key uh, reusable bag. Um, I received this for Christmas 2019. So I've had it um, for about, or at least 10 months now. Um, Loki as a brand, that's the brand tag there, um, makes s uh, reusable backpacks, shopping bags, zipper pockets and luggage covers. Um, they produce various artists and museum collections featuring various works of art by a variety of artists. Uh, this bag is from the birth of Venus. Um, and is in the museum collection. Uh, the artist is Sandro Botticelli. Um, okay, so um, I imagine that uh, you could quite possibly recognise um, this uh, portrait. Um, you know, it is quite a popular one. Um, this bag itself is 55 grams um, and it folds into, this is actually the carry bag portion, uh, the little bag portion of it. So it folds into this and then, so that is the little zippered bag and then this is the bag itself um, and you can also um, with these bags, fold them up um, to. Okay, I'm not actually going to fold this up nice and pretty, it's just to demonstrate. Um, you can also fold these up because it has this um, bit at the top, and um, you just. you can actually just do this with it. I'm sure you get the picture um, and you can do it up and then it is squishes up in your bag that way and you can use the zippered pouch for other things so obviously it is up to you how um, you do that. Um, so as I said it is 55 grams. Um, and um, you can either do it folded up or um, in the little zipper bag. It is rated to hold up to 20 kilos. Um, however, um, it depends if this, how well this comes up on screen, to be honest with you. Um, so, if you guys can see, it is all coming apart. So, um, this is, um, yeah, so in 10 months, um, I don't think I've had over 20 kilos in here, um, because really I just use these to pick up a couple of things on the way, um, home, um, if I need something to complete a meal. It's basically come apart all along the edges. And uh, the sides aren't so bad, but um, these straps, when it focuses, you'll see what I mean, if it wants to focus, has completely come apart too. So this should technically be sewn up like this, um, but it has completely come apart. Um, so this is technically how the strap should look and it definitely does not so here we go we'll show from the inside so these uh this strap has come apart too um it's actually torn through at that point um, there is on the inside this pocket um, uh, here where obviously you can add so this one's not going to come apart because it's just sewn up the um, sewn at the edges so from the inside ah, 
you will see the same thing that it is all coming apart. So this bottom bit is just this okay, I'm gonna single stitch which seems a bit insane being that they've done this type of um, stitching for the side once it focuses so this is the stitching for the side of the bag and this is the stitching for the bottom of the bag that is currently falling apart um, if it's focusing up really close you can actually see how holy it is um, and how all of that is starting to fray so all of these bottom parts near where the stitching is is starting to fray as well so um, it is so that has the instructions on the side of it how to use and, and that you can fold it roll it or stuff it um, so on the back here it says um, the more you use me the happier you make me or the more you use me the more I break um, it is um, Oecotex standard 100 it is tested for harmful substances which so it is 100% polyester made in China so yes this is the bag um, 10 months in and it's not even my uh, my only reusable bag so it's not like it's the only thing that I have to use and it's definitely not been the only thing that I have used I usually use my red bubble totes which are cotton and have a better straps on them um, and those ones get beaten around a lot um, and even with this bag here um, um, this the stitching on this isn't holding up either once it focuses so the stitching on this bag I'm going to just rip it out they've at least attempted to um, sew it up better but again they've reinforced the uh, sides of this pocket and not the bottom so the same type of thing has happened with this in the fact that the bottom stitching is coming out and getting quite bad so um, this as you can see falls down quite um, small and flat um, which is um, okay it does fold down very small and very flat and is actually one of the smallest reusable bags that I have in the um, in the footprint that it has in my bag or in my handbag um, which is actually generally um, when I tend to use this when I'm taking out a tote bag or something or a very small bag or a um, bum bag is that um, this will actually quite easily fold down and fit into that um, However, the consequences of this fragility is that it is falling apart in 10 months. Um, so reusable bags that I have that are, have a bigger fold down or a bigger footprint in your bag can be very inconvenient, um, but they don't fall apart as easy. Um, this is the smaller, it has the convenient zipper pouch, um, it has an internal pocket, um, so it's all very convenient for the size of this bag that this bag folds out to. Um, however, is it worth having it essentially rip at the bottom after 10 months, um, meaning that I'm going to have to replace, either replace it anyway, I, I won't replace it because I have other reusable bags. Um, and this was part of a Christmas present. Um, but, you know, this is also not the full painting, nor even the full portrait of Venus, um, which I find very, very strange. 
um especially you can obviously look up the birth of venus online um to see the full picture but she's actually not naked in the picture um she's not wearing a lot of clothes but she's covered by hair and shells i believe um and so it's not like there's pity there's a suggest there's probably more of a suggestion of nudity in this picture than there is in the actual full picture um, so I found it quite strange that they don't do the full picture or the full portrait. Um, it would be nice to have the entire artwork, even if it's a bit smaller, instead of this truncated piece, um, you know, or just this kind of head portion of the artwork. Um, anyway, I wish it wasn't falling apart after 10 months. Um, it's, that seems to be um, breaking, making it a less than particularly sustainable, reusable bag. Um, so... It was a bit disappointing on that front that it is breaking. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, links will be in the description box below so that you um, can check them out or Loki out. Um, in, but other than that, enjoy your morning, afternoon or evening depending on where you are in the day. And I, of course, will catch up with you all in the next video. Bye, everyone.